Ladies, I'm talking to you today. Have you been struggling to get your shit together? Do you find yourself on a regular basis, like feeling really, really awesome and you feel like you're, you're like, like gonna conquer the world and then all of a sudden it's like, fuck, what happened again? Why did I just lose it all? And why did I lose all this momentum? And then you feel like you gotta get your shit together again. Well, guess what? Did you know you're not a dude? Dudes have like a linear nature. We, as women, have a cyclical nature, and we often forget that. Hi, by the way, I'm Aubrey Warren, and if you're if we're just getting to know each other, I empower people with the tools to lead an inspired life on a regular basis, and then I create spaces for us to gather together to celebrate this awesome life. And actually, I'm reading a book right now that has me so inspired. It's called Love Your Lady Landscape. Yes, I'm going to say that again. It's called Love Your Lady Landscape, and it's by Lisa Lester. And it's the idea of this. We as women are cyclical. And here's the part that's interesting is the first gr group of doctors to ever come out were men. And think about this for just a second. Everything that is now science, before they figured out what it was, before they figured it out, everything that is now considered science was once considered magic. Our bodies are magical. And we, our bodies are able to do some amazing things. And consider with the amazing things that our bodies are able to do, the different hormonal changes that happen within us. And so, we as women, we can be going awesome for a while and then our hormones shift and then it's like crash and burn. But I've come to an idea and that is it's because we're not embracing our cyclical nature. Instead, we as women have been given a roadmap for success, which is linear which are how dudes work, how dudes, they don't have shifting on their hormones on a monthly basis, cyclically, like we do. So there's something I found is called empowered time management. And based on what's going on in your body hormonally, you can actually use your body and those hormones to claim your feminine superpowers instead of beating yourself with a shame stick as to why you can't get shit done during one week of the month because you got other stuff going on in your bodies. And so I told you that I create spaces for people to gather together to celebrate your awesome life, right? Well, that's actually what I'm doing. The next new moon women's circle that's happening at Keller Yoga that I am leading with Jamie Lee, a resident astrologer, I'm going to be actually sharing with you women hormonally what's going on in our bodies and how we can claim that as a superpower where you can use those hormones within your body and use them to give you extra waves of energy. Or did you know, ladies, right before your cycle and right actually when you start to bleed is supposedly when we are the most in tune with our psychic abilities and our natural healing abilities. So if we slow down during that time, we can really gain more wisdom and insight from what the universe is trying to give us during that point in time. So if this like sparks any sort of interest in you or curiosity within you, come to the next New Moon Women's Circle. Um, I believe it's April 5th. It's the first Friday in April at Keller Yoga. Or if you're interested in any of the, these ideas, do me a favor, drop a message below, and I'd love to get you hooked up with this book because it, I'm gonna be honest with you, I totally shifted the way I treated my body over this past month, past month to honor my cycl cyclical nature instead of to force myself to be linear, linear and to be the same all the time. And the, actually the embracing of the secular nature allowed me to feel more powerful, more in tuned and more at ease in my mind and in my body. So if you've been struggling to get your shit together, con consider this. Maybe it's because of the expectation that you have upon yourself to be a dude when you're not a dude.
to perform like a dude when you're not a dude. Because if we allow ourselves to let go of an expectation that's put upon ourselves that we didn't ask for, um, then it's time that we can claim ourselves as superwomen instead of waiting for that Prince Charming to come along and give us a kiss that's going to wake us up and to change everything. Time to embrace the bodies that we've been given and acknowledge ourselves for the she-women that we are. Have a great day. I hope this resonates. If it did, like it, love it, give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you're thinking because I'm all about embracing the feminine body and the hormones and the blessings we've been given by Mama Nature. So have a great day. Hope to see you at the next new, new moon women's circle, ladies. Peace, love, and fairy dust.